this stuff here is absolutely brilliant. It's made by Fox. It's called Armour Mesh, and it's actually designed for the guys fishing over in France, um, fishing boilies and and and, and whatever. Uh, and it's to protect the baits from crayfish. It's basically it's called Armour Mesh. Basically, if you open the tube up here, what you've got inside is you've got this mesh bag here. You tie a knot in one end to secure the end. You've got a funnel and a little plunger there. Now you can put any sort of soft bait that you want, you just shove it down there, get the plunger, push that in, and it compacts it all up the end, you'll see how it, how it looks in a minute. What I've got here from Andy's baits, um, look at the state of that, look. that is just full of juice and gunk and whatever, and you'll see when I push this through here how much juice comes out. This is These are scallop frills, there we go, mushy, horrible stuff, but the old cod love it. It's full of juice, full of scent, and you literally just poke this stuff in there, poke it in the hole, and then get your plunger, and you push it down, and if you can see there as the old plunger comes out, boom, there you go. What you want to do, make sure that's secure, give it two or three twists, like that, and then just literally tie a knot on the end, pull it out like that. You can pull this down quite tight actually, with a bit of practice. There we go. A pair of scissors. Cut that off. At this point, always remember to tie a knot in the end. And pull that back up up there, so you're ready to go again. Step the plunger back in. Ready to rock. So there you go. You've got a real, look at all this, look at all this juice coming out here already. Look. Nice little compact bait. I've got a size 4.0 Sakuma Manta here, which is one of my preferred hooks for, for uptide in for cod. And all you've got to do literally is just hook it like that. Now that it's actually really quite hard to get off. I'm going to have to cut that off this hook if I want to use it again uh, because of the, the way the mesh meshes. It just it's not going to come off. Cast that out, and uh, yeah, you're going to catch cod on that. You can use anything you like in there. You can use mussels. You can use bits of mashed up pea the crab, you can use bits of mackerel, if you've got mackerel in the freezer that's gone a bit mushy, use that. Uh, anything, anything you like. Lugworm, even if you've got some lugworm that's sort of blow lug that's blown, that there's no way you're going to get it on a hook, whack it in there because it's all scent at the end of the day. And that's what cod home in on, especially this time of year, when our water's really murky and the, the cod are relying on scent. But yeah, armour mesh from Fox. They do it in, to my knowledge they do it in two sizes. This one's wide. Uh, they do a thin size as well. Uh, you can get refills that just literally slide up here. It just comes in a comes in a, in a tube, really compact. You just push it on the end and slide it up. But that's going to last you for ages. You, you'll get a lot of baits out of that. There's a hell of a lot of that stuff on there that keeps going, keeps going. So there you go. Give that a try. Very, very effective. I've used it quite a lot uh, in the Humber. I've used it in the Thames with varying baits. Uh, and it works an absolute treat.